Hey Virgos and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for February 7th, 2019. This is for all Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Virgos. So let's see what you guys have going on in love. Your guys' first card out is the Six of Pentacles. I'm going to tip you guys down so you can see me shuffling. The Lovers and the Two of Wands. What is Virgo dealing with? All right. The person you are dealing with is the Sun, the Ace of Swords. And the wands. Bottom of the deck is the seven of wands. Could be feeling defensive like you against the world right now. All right, we will go over your shared energy first. You are um, coming to an end of a major life cycle, deciding to move forward, move on, and close out anything from the past that you have healed from, that you uh, need to walk away from. You are ending one life cycle and moving right into the next. Um, you are leaving behind uh, a situation that you feel like there is always conflict. Um, and if there's not always conflict, this is inner conflict. You didn't know whether to stay or go. You didn't know whether to stay with this uh, old situation that you're dealing with or to start over a new, start over uh, a new chapter. Could be You could be leaving a fixed sign um, and moving towards a fire sign with two wands here. But you haven't gone into this decision lightly. You've taken a, taken a long time to decide what to do. But I do see you um, bringing things to a close with one uh, person in your life. To give a new beginning, to have a fresh start with somebody else. There could be um, some arguments with this person that you are walking away from and ending things with about a fire sign as well. Okay, Virgos. So uh, you guys have been, uh, yeah, this is all about finding balance between love and your life, love for yourself, love for another. Um, you in the past were splitting your energy between two people, two situations, two things. Um, and it was affecting your love life. You are faced with a choice on who to move forward with, who to leave behind and who to move forward with. This is a divine connection because we have Archangel Michael over the couple. Uh, and you're really, you're really looking past whatever you are experiencing in the present moment. You're going deep within. You are looking out over your life and thinking, where do I go from here? What do I truly want? Who do I let go of and leave behind? And who do I move forward with, um, who's going to allow you to be your real you is what I just heard. So, um, you are, you are trying to figure out which path to take and you are going deep within, uh, Virgos today. You are really doing some self-reflection. Um, and you see, it's kind of cool with this card coming out right next to it. You are asking, you know, your angels, you're asking, uh, 
you know, somebody in heaven, whoever it is, you're asking, what do I do? Where do I go? That's part of this inner reflection or inner conflict that you've been having. You're looking to the heavens for answers. You've been asking other people. You've been listening to others' opinions. And now you're going within and you're asking for help from your angels from heaven. Um, and you see in this card, him looking up and up at Archangel Michael here. And you are going to find the answer when you go within and when you ask your angels for help. He is going to bless you and the and the right person you're meant to be with. So you're going within, you're asking your angels for help. You are making a choice. You're ending one phase of your life and moving into the next. The person that you are dealing with, uh, <clears throat> they have a lot of inner light. This person is very connected to source. This person um, is out in the community. They, you know, everybody knows them and they are they're just walking their own path. They're doing their own thing. Their vibration is so high. They walk into a room and they light the whole room up. Um, people like to be around this person. They're very energetic. They're very uh, friendly. People are just like naturally drawn to them because of their vibration. Uh, and they are on, they're doing their own thing. They're just, because that's what they want to do. Um, and it's being guided by the divine. They are doing their own thing, but they're doing it in a spiritual way. And their vibration is just very intense, very high. Um, you know, they're speaking their truth. They're walking their truth. Uh, they have a new beginning that they want to set out on you or set out with you on. This is them being awakened to the, to the divine, to the spiritual realm. This person is, uh, psychic this person is this person can see the truth without having to hear the truth um they're very connected very intuitive very psychic um and they're just waiting for you to uh acknowledge the truth of what this connection is what this spiritual connection is how you guys are connected the bond that the two of you share they're waiting for you to figure that out virgo they're very um, financially stable. They are very well grounded. They have their life together and they're just, they're just making coin while they're waiting for you to make a choice to come with them, to be with them. Um, you are manifesting your blessings here with the outcome today. Your ships are coming in if you allow them to. Um, you guys are at a distance right now physically, but you won't be for much longer. I do see this moving in a direction with the two of you together because you are going to take a leap of faith. You are going to decide to um, throw caution to the wind and give this relationship a second chance. Um, the sun is in both of them. So this is guided by the divine. This is a twin flame relationship. Um and you're going to uh, reach out to this fire sign. You're going, you could send a message um, to them. You could, uh, or they to you, because I don't see really much communication here yet. You could have blocked this person um, while you figured out uh, what you were going to do because you had to figure it out for yourself. You didn't want a bunch of outside influence, but you're figuring it out. You're manifesting this relationship into the material. You're going to take a leap of faith with this person, Virgo, and it's going to be very passionate, very fun, very adventurous. As soon as you let go, you have to let go of one of those wands in order to get the ace of wands and the new beginning with this person that you truly are wanting once you, um, once you get that communication from your angels, from the heavens, you will move into this relationship. Also, Virgo, when you decide to be with this fire sign, with this person, it could be Aries, Leo. Yeah, I got all three, Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo here. But when you decide to move in the direction and have this new beginning, you're going to become more stable. You're going to become financially abundant. This connection is going to bring you the two of you will do something together that is going to bring you a lot of wealth. Um, we got Gemini. We got uh, all fire signs. Uh, 
any fixed sign. Actually, you're, don't even don't even concentrate on signs because people get all hung up on that. But yeah, when you come together in this relationship, the two of you will create something that's going to make you both financially successful. So once you hear the truth from the divine, from uh, Archangel Michael, you will move forward and take this leap of faith. And when you find balance and um, the two of yours path will come back together, you will manifest this person into uh, the material and you will have this new beginning, Virgos. So, all right, guys, I hope you have a beautiful Thursday. I will see you next time. God bless.